Hey, hey, it is David. Welcome or welcome back to Cross Fitness, helping men and women get in the best spiritual shape of their lives, one workout at a time. Quick thought about God here I want to share with you in this short video that I'm calling Be Encouraged, We Win! Exclamation point. That's what the thumbnail says. That's why you clicked here, and I'm going to encourage you today. You know, the reality is we live in a fallen world, in a mortal body, amidst a flawed and imperfect people of which we are part of that people group, right? So no harm, no foul there. And yet, given that condition, and as bad as it is, as you look around 360 degrees in the world in which we live, the culture, the society, and all the things we could list and name that are negative, be encouraged, we win. Who's we? I'm going to talk about the body of Christ, the children of God, the priesthood of believers, the church of the living God, the saints of God. That's you. If you're a born-again believer, man, before this thing is all said and done, the devil is in the lake of fire and you and I are in a glorified body in a new heaven and a new earth with Jesus. <laughs> we are tabernacling with God in person for in forever, for infinity. Uh, and that's, that's a win beyond imagination. And no wonder the Bible says to set your mind on things above, not on things of the earth, you know? And, um, and to think on things that are honest and lovely and good and just and of good report. This is Philippians 4, verse 8. And, you know, if you ever get, you know, down to the dumps with your tail between your legs, you know, just, just read Revelation 21 and 22. This is how this thing ends up. Uh, you know, the Bible started strong. And then this messy middle of Genesis chapter 3 with the fall of man, right? Okay, but God sent a Redeemer. His name is Jesus. And because of Jesus, because of Jesus, you have everything you need pertaining to life and godliness. You have access, unlimited, anytime, anywhere, in any circumstance, all access to the throne of grace to obtain mercy and find help in time of need. Okay? So we not only win then, we win now. Okay? It's not just about there, it's about here. Okay? And I'm talking about living the Christ life, the Jesus life, following the God trail, you know? And as we put our, our foot forward one unglamorous day at a time, one controversial day at a time, you know, one difficult day at a time. It's okay. It's okay. Because God is with us. God is for us. God is in us. And that, my friend, is an encouraging word to take into your day to know that you're going to win. So whatever the score is at halftime, as you go into the locker room, all beat up, don't worry about it. Because before this thing is said and done, we are going to win and come out on top as the people of God. And that is to the praise of God's glory because of the cross of Jesus Christ. All right, so be encouraged. I hope you have a good day. For now, I'm David, your virtual mentor, reminding you that I'm always for you. I am never against you. Take care and have a great day.